and put the number of starts at three. The next cutter we get to now choose, and that's our hollowing tool. I'm going to use a two flute straight cutter that's a half inch in diameter and it has a two inch cutting length. So if we select that tool, and now this has its own starting and ending position as well. Uh, so let's do six and 12 over here. Six and 12 at the start and um, end. Here, I'm just going to put a half of an inch wide slot. And the last thing is, what is the section diameter? And so over here, that's this two and a half inch diameter section that's already been turned around. So let's put that in there, 2.5, and we are done, and we can go finish and save. And now let's generate our G-code. So now let's go to the machine and see what this does to the part. It begins at the start position, plunges down, and performs multiple roughing passes down the length of the stock while rotating. Notice that the stock rotates to position this half-inch cutter to make sure that this hollowing section is happening along the exact same tool path for both cutters. All the cutting advantages shown here that include both cutters being combined into one tool path is automatically built into CCAM Pro.